Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm here with a new hair tutorial on how I achieve these big fluffy curls using flexi rods and absolutely no heat. These were achieved overnight, so if you'd like to see how I got this look, then keep watching. I'm using two products today, both by Shea Moisture. One is the Weightless Styling Mousse, and the other is the Raw Shea Butter Transitioning Milk. And of course, you'll need some flexi rods. I'm starting off on about four day old hair. This is an old wash and go that I stretched out. I just wanted to get in one more style before it was wash day. So the first thing I'm gonna do is separate my hair into two sections. I'll be using my hands to separate some fairly medium to large size sections of hair. So I'm taking both the styling mousse and the moisture milk and raking them through each section of hair. Then I'm taking the flexi rod. I'm gonna start at the very end of my hair and then roll it up towards my scalp. To secure the rod in place, I'm simply folding the arms over. So I'm just gonna repeat this process throughout my entire head. If you want your curls to be more tight and defined, you're gonna use smaller sections and a lot more flexi rods. But since I want this look to be more fluffy and looser curls, I'm using bigger, chunkier sections and fewer rods. I think I'm only using about 13 for this look. Uh, that may sound like a lot, but I have a really big head and a lot of hair. <laughs> The combination of both the products I used on my transitioning hair worked really well together. The styling mousse allows for a really soft, gentle hold without having your hair feeling crunchy or hard. And the moisture milk allows your hair to be soft and moisturized without weighing it down. Don't worry about trying to be so perfect and precise when parting or even rolling up the rods. I like that this style allows me to be a little messy. I can take my time with it. And as long as I pretty much have the shape that will be set overnight, then the end result will turn out exactly how I want it. Okay, ladies, so this is important. Um, although we want to secure the rods in place, we don't wanna roll them up too tight, especially around the perimeter of our head to where it's pulling on our edges and it's uncomfortable. So if you happen to be securing a rod and you do feel that it's too tight, don't be afraid to start over and do it again because we wanna protect our edges and our baby hair. The last thing we need is some thinning edges, right? So let's protect our perimeter.
I'm almost done. I have one section left. I just had to shake my shoulders out real quick, but I see the light at the end of the tunnel. So I finally have all the rods in place now. This is what it looks like. I'm about to get ready for bed and I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning. I guess I didn't sleep too crazy because all my rods are still in place. So we're gonna go ahead and start taking them out. Make sure before taking these rods out that you are sure that your hair is completely dry. Whether you started on soaking wet hair or dry hair and just added product like I did, you wanna make sure that even the product is completely dry. That is the key to a successful and perfect flexi rod set. So I'm taking some of this finishing elixir by Shea Moisture. I'm gonna spray some in my hand before separating each curl. This product is actually one of my favorite products. You can probably tell by the almost empty bottle, but it's really great to use on for finishing um, hairstyles like this. The oil is really lightweight and uh, doesn't leave your hair feeling oily or greasy at all. Doing a little scalp massage to get some blood circulating. I'm gonna take some of this Blueberry Bliss Control Paste and just apply it around my perimeter and lay down these edges. Now, if I wanted to leave my hair just like this, I could. This is cute, this is fine, it has a little bit of defined curls. But today I want more. I want more volume, I want more length, I want more frizz, I want that diva hair, that messy, fluffy curl, you know what I mean? You know that it looks like she just got out of bed but damn her hair still look good hair? That's the hair I'm looking for. So what I'm going to do is take a comb and gently comb out these curls. I know what you're thinking, you're going to mess up everything you just worked so hard on, but I know what I'm doing. Loosening up these curls a bit is going to make this hair fluffy, but still keep that curl undertone. You'll see what I'm talking about in a minute. Yes, come through volume, come through. Now this, this beautiful mess right here is the hair I was looking for. Filled with volume, soft, fluffy. This is called my diva hair. This style was so easy to achieve. My hair feels super soft and super lightweight. And that's it loves this is the final look thank you again for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe and stay tuned for more of my videos Bye.